Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick video to let you know that Microsoft has released an update for its Microsoft Defender browser protection extension recently, which they have once again made available um, through the Chrome Web Store. Now, they previously discontinued the extension and due to user feedback now have um, re-released -re an updated version which they rolled out on the 30th of May. So that's just a couple of days ago. So this is a very recent update uh, to the new version and uh, um, is available from the Chrome Web Store for you to download. And I'll leave a link to this page down below for easy access and reference if you do want to install it uh, in your web browser. Now, one or two things um, this extension does bring to the table, um, if you are interested, is um, as many of you would know, as an example, if you are using Google Chrome, um, Google Chrome has a safe browsing feature built into the browser that protects you against online threats. So what the actual um, um, extension will do from Microsoft over and above um, that safe browsing feature, as an example, if you are using it in Chrome, it will also protect you against malicious and phishing sites. So what it's doing is just bringing basically an extra layer of security and protection. So if you are concerned about your online privacy and safety and security or are into, you know, just keeping yourself protected when using your browser online, then um, you may want to just give this a try as an extra layer of defense and protection as mentioned. Now to add this to your web browser, obviously you head over to this page, which I mentioned I'd leave down below. You just click on add to Chrome, add extension, and that'll take a second or two before it gets installed and if we just head over to that, if I just head to my extensions, Microsoft Defender browser protection, here we go. Uh, there is the extension that has been installed. Now, once installed, basically what it does, uh, it checks for sites you visit by using Microsoft's smart screen web service that um, is powered by the Microsoft um, Defender app. And, uh, and what it'll do if you do try to visit a site um, that was reported previously for phishing attacks or scams or malware, what it'll do is it'll stop you from going to that site and it'll show a warning page, a red warning page. And if we head back to the actual uh, web store, here we go, it'll show you a warning very similar to that. So it'll give you a big alert and you know then that obviously that is a dodgy site. Now, some of the um, uh, improvements that the extension um, has rolled out with in this updated version, which is version 1.66, is that it has been migrated to Manifest V3 from Manifest V2, which is good news. Uh, as mentioned, um, it does come with a faster performance and um, also a lower bandwidth usage and also includes bug fixes and also introduces new group policy controls. And by the way, this can be used um, in basically all your different Chromium web browsers like Chrome, uh, Brave, Vivaldi. But just take note though, um, uh, it cannot be used in Microsoft Edge because Microsoft Edge already has the same technology already built directly into the browser. But nonetheless, just bringing that to your attention that the Microsoft Defender browser privacy protection um, extension is now available for Chromium web browsers if you'd like to make use of that and just install it. And just on a side note, one thing to take note of is don't install too many ad blockers and browser guards and browser protection extensions. Because um, if you have too many installed, um, it can degrade and slow down the performance um, of your browser, which is not a good thing. And really, you defeat the object by, by um, installing too many uh, browser protection extensions in um, Google Chrome, as an example. So just take note of that. Don't install too many uh, extensions because it could slow down the performance of your browser. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.